Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today is day like 552 of quarantine week. Who the heck knows? And it has led me to deciding to paint. And I haven't painted literally anything since I think I think I was in grade 12, maybe. But I used to paint a lot in my spare time and I decided to do it now because I have so many art supplies just lying around because I go to an art school and you need like the most random supplies all the time. So I decided to paint. I'm not the best painter, but we're gonna do some minimalist painting that I found on Pinterest and I'm just going to just kind of talk sit down see what everyone else is doing i just want to address that everyone in my house except for my mom works from home now so i'm trying to whisper so the audio might not be the best also my appearance is terrible i tried and it just didn't work out so i found these three boards they're actually meant for watercolor but i don't know why i decided to use acrylic paint on it um i just drew a couple like sketchy things and like labeled them um i have three of them i don't think i'm going to do all three of them because like that seems like a lot i did test out a paint swatch already i also just went ahead and mixed my paint already just because i don't want to spend the time mixing my paint i don't even know if this is gonna like work out well maybe i'll do these two just because i'm gonna start off with this one um and then and then we'll go from there. the type of paint that i'm using is this one i'm not even gonna try to pronounce it because i don't know how but i'll leave a link in the description box below where you can get it or where i got it i'm really hoping that i don't get this off a sweater because acrylic paint does not come off so um i have my paint brushes i have this mug of water that i always use when i'm painting i have paper towels and everything and i just wanted to sit down chat and paint with you guys this isn't so much like a paint with me it's more of just like a chit chat while i paint kind of thing i am not the best painter and i'm just gonna go in and start with the yellow color but i always like to wet my brush first i feel like everyone is a little just like stir crazy i think we're on week like seven of quarantine and i think i've left my house maybe three times total it's very rare that i will ever go outside of my house because i don't want to we're living in like a really weird time where no one's really experienced living in a pandemic before if you follow me on instagram which it's always in the description box down below but every social media account that i have is just at kiana gabrielle underscore it'll be on screen i posted something where um this was when people weren't really taking social distancing seriously and was really just starting to make me really angry that people weren't starting to take it seriously because so many people in my family work in the healthcare system whether it's like the type of nurses who come to your house or my mom she works at a hospital in toronto like hearing their stories and everything and people just not taking it seriously it just really blew my mind that i just had to say something because like it's so easy to joke around with it in the beginning but it's like once you start taking it seriously like people like it's not a joke and people are actually like dying from it um so i just wanted to put that out there but as of right now it is 4 20 i think for like april 20th i've been done school for about like I finished on the 9th. All my stuff got moved online on March the 13th and I've just been completing things online and my last project was due April the 9th so I've been off for quite a long time. My friends have school still so I'm just kind of chilling trying to keep myself occupied which is why I'm making this video. I haven't been on YouTube in a long time but I thought like now was a perfect time to come back because what else do I have to do? Typically I would be getting a summer job doing interviews and things like that or working in general recently if you watch any sort of news you know that america wants to reopen their like economy which is 
probably one of the stupidest moves that you could ever do in my opinion. I hope everyone is staying healthy, trying to really social distance themselves because that is honestly truly one of the one things that will get us through this pandemic because obviously everyone wants to return to somewhat of a normal life. I don't think that a completely normal post, I mean pre-quarantine life is really attainable because we went through a freaking pandemic. I don't know how, like no one knows how long this is going to take. I'm really hoping that it doesn't go into September though because I would really appreciate if I could just go back to school. I don't know. I never thought I would miss like commuting to school and everything but I really I really miss it. Commuting is probably the worst things about going to school in the city because you have to- oh shit. <laughs> I- so this is what I have done so far. I didn't even wait for the yellow to dry and I just started painting the pink because I got distracted. You know what I miss? I miss having a routine. If you still have a routine in quarantine, you are amazing because I don't know how you did it. I had a routine for a while and then once school started to slow down I was like okay I don't need a routine anymore and now I just feel like I'm like off the rails and I have no idea how I'm gonna start getting back into like just real life. I hope that everyone is staying sane. For me personally the first 14 days I was really dealing with like some sort of anxiety because 14 days is when like the time period of when the virus could show up and I was just really paranoid because university is like just school in general is just filled with just like millions of unknown germs so I was just really paranoid. Once the 14 days was up I kind of started to relax. I've recently started been like dealing with sleep insomnia. That sounded weird. Sleep insomnia. I'm fine some days falling asleep but uh, sorry if you can hear my sister but other days I can't seem to get to sleep but most days regardless of what time I fall asleep I find myself waking up around like 5 36 which I always woke up at 8 o'clock. I even when I went to school I would either wake up at 6 to get to my, my 8.30 classes or I would wake up at around 8. Um, 8 was when I typically woke up every day but for some reason I just can't like go to sleep, I can't stay asleep, I feel I don't know why. Also this channel has grown a lot. I don't know how but it has. I think a lot of people are finding me from my <laughs> from me boiling my jeans, which I did that video as a joke, but the amount of people who watched it because they wanted to learn how to shrink their jeans is insane. I like filming these just like sit down chit chat videos, but because we're in quarantine, let me know any other video ideas because I'm really open to doing other things and I'm so bored honestly that I will literally do anything. I do have a couple videos planned but I'm always open and I don't know how long we'll be here so it could be a while. I just have my two like vases done, vase, I don't know what you freaking call them. Oh, I'm gonna paint the background first. I think that's a good idea. I'm gonna paint the background beige or maybe I should wait for this to dry. Yeah, acrylic paint does dry really fast which is nice for this purpose. The good thing about quarantine is I've been really spending a lot of time with my sisters because there's literally nobody else to talk to besides like my parents. That's fun. I don't know. I saw this tweet where it was like, how, how are only children doing? Which really got me thinking, like if you're an only child, like how are you doing? Because for me, like I would just be bored out of my mind. Like what do you do? But I guess like you're used to being an only child, like that's your just whole life. What else have I been doing? I learned how to cook, which I never thought I would do, but I, I did it. I've done so like many things I didn't think I was ever gonna do. I'm surprised that my sisters and I haven't been fighting 
as much as I thought that we would. I guess we don't fight because we know that there's literally nobody else to talk to. Yeah, everyone in my house has like actual like real people work to do. So I just kind of have to find ways to entertain myself half the time. And half the time I sit in bed I'm watching Netflix, but I've watched so much Netflix. Like it's crazy. I finished the show You. It was so messed up. It was such a weird show. If you've never watched You, it is freaking messed up. He's like out of his freaking mind. I'm also drinking that Dalgona TikTok coffee, whatever. And let me tell you, it's like not good. Like if you're thinking about trying it, don't. Like it's not good. So I just did that. I literally freaking tried to paint like the leaf in black and I realized I hated it. It was like too thick and I'm like, mm. I hated it. I'm honestly thinking about like leaving just like two vases and like a beige background because I don't want to do this anymore. And I feel like I've talked too much in this video. It's still like wet. Can we see? Like, oh, I just like made it worse. I don't know. Oh my God. I messed up. Okay, so this is what my picture looks like right now, and they're supposed to be like leaves, but I'm just like so over painting right now. I still have like two of these boards, so maybe we'll do this again, but I just don't want to do this anymore. Like my attention span as we started quarantine has just like really gone down. I also talked for like a good 30 minutes. If you enjoyed this video at any point, give it a thumbs up. Also subscribe to my channel right down below and I will see you guys in my next video, hopefully next Thursday at 12 p.m. Bye!